In this tutorial video, I'll teach you how to add a background image to the mobile menu of your Squarespace website. I'm Becca from Inside the Square, and as always, the codes I'm about to share with you are listed directly underneath this video, but there are a few important parts of this code that you'll want to customize. So I'll go ahead and share my screen and teach you exactly how to use this code in Squarespace and how to make it uniquely yours. Let's get started. Here we are inside Squarespace, and on the left-hand side of the screen, I'm going to navigate to my Pages menu. Then I'll select Custom Code, and then Custom CSS. If your menu doesn't look like mine, hit the forward slash key on your keyboard and search for your CSS panel to navigate there directly. Now, before we add Custom Code, we need to add the image that we'll be using as the background to our custom files. I'm going to click this dropdown and then click this plus sign to upload the file from my computer. Now we can add some custom code, but first let's go ahead and open up that mobile menu so we can see what happens when we add this code to Squarespace. All right, I'll zoom in on the screen here a little bit. This is the code that you'll find directly underneath this video. Place your cursor in between the parentheses right after the words background image URL. Then click on your custom files and select the image that you just uploaded. That will place the URL right there inside your code and we can now see the background image being used for our mobile menu. If we close the mobile menu or look at the desktop version of our website, we're not going to see that anywhere else. The image is just here as the background of the mobile menu for our Squarespace website. Now there are two other lines of code here. The next is background size cover. There are other values that you can use here, but I recommend using cover because of how many different mobile device sizes there are. Cover is going to make sure that the image will fill the entire screen. After that, we have background position. Here I've selected center. This is what I prefer to use when I'm using this code, but you can get really specific if you want to. You can align the image with the left-hand side of the screen and the top of the screen or the right-hand side of the screen and the bottom. But again, I prefer to use center when I'm using the background position code to place an image as the background of my mobile menu. Underneath this video, you'll find the codes that we use to make that magic happen in Squarespace. I've also included a few links to other helpful resources for you. I'm Becca from Inside the Square, and I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a like and let me know in the comments. And if you have any questions about Squarespace, let me know in the comments. I'd love to help. Thank you so much for watching my video. And most importantly, have fun with your Squarespace website. Bye for now. Good news, Squarespacer. We finally have an AI that truly understands Squarespace. Meet Custom Cody. Built specifically for Squarespace users and trained on every nuance of the program, Custom Cody is your AI-powered assistant for effortless expert-level Squarespace customization. Available now at customcody.com.